Earth's first small research satellite launched into orbit on July 4th. The satellite, designed and built by students at the University of Maine, captures images of the Earth and collects climate data. Well, three months now after the launch, students are already using the data across various fields of research. New Center Maine's Katie Delaney shows us the impact this out-of-this-world project is having on students and the entire state of Maine. It's really exciting. Inside UMaine's wireless sensing lab, PhD student Armand Kiani receives and observes data from the satellite. He moved to Maine from Iran to make his mark in satellite research. It's the best place to work on projects and be motivated to keep going. Dr. Ali Abedi, the leader of the project, says over 4,000 people around the world receive the satellite's climate data to be used for all kinds of research, studying things like climate change, water quality, and energy. The reach is uh, basically almost broad and unlimited, and it only depends on imagination of the students, how they get the data and how they interpret it. PhD student Mursida Naji Shabahain is using data from the satellite in her research on wireless propagation in forests. She uses the satellite's pictures of Maine to adapt her research as forests change. It's kind of unbelievable. It feels so good seeing um, the satellite uh, that's working great and sending scientific data and engineering data. Dr. Abedi says this project not only supports the space industry in Maine, it can also help make tourism, agriculture and other industries in the state more efficient. I think that feeling that the students can contribute to the economy, give back to the people of the state of Maine, makes us very happy. Giving students hands-on research experience. It really can build your knowledge base and it, it really it grounds the things you learn in the classroom and ties it back together into real world experiences. It's very valuable experience. Students preparing for future careers in engineering and space, shooting for the stars. It's an opportunity for me to um, look forward. In Orono, Katie Delaney, New Center, Maine. The satellite's orbit, by the way, is expected to last anywhere from six months to two years. The project is part of NASA's CubeSat launch initiative through a partnership with the Maine Space Grant Consortium.